So on the left, if I click the heart icon, you'll see it come up here on the right, which is Firefox. So let me click the heart here, and you can see. So if I click the fire icon, if I click the spaceship icon, uh, mind blown icon, so if I start clicking them all, so this is this is all happening over WebSocket. So here over in Firefox, it is not polling the server, it is using a WebSocket connection and uh, displays data in real time. Laravel Reverb. What is it and how does it work? In this video, I get to answer those questions. So what is Reverb? Reverb is a first-party WebSocket server for Laravel applications, bringing real-time communication between client and server. It is a first-party package built by the Laravel team. Thanks, Taylor. So how does it work? It is a WebSocket server, but what are WebSockets? WebSockets is a communication protocol that provides full duplex communication channels over a single long-lived connection. So you have clients sending data to each other at the same time, for example, in chat applications or on a phone call. You can speak and someone can hear you and also speak at the same time. So WebSockets are designed to be implemented in web browsers and web servers, but can also be used in other scenarios such as mobile apps. WebSockets offer a more efficient and real-time alternative to traditional HTTP request-response communication. Because in HTTP, a client makes a, re a request, a server processes it, and then responds. So there can't be communication at the same time. So that's where WebSockets come in. So what are the features of Reverb? Blazing fast. Reverb is fine-tuned for speed. A single server can support thousands of connections piping data without a delay and inefficiency of HTTP polling. What is HTTP polling? This is where we send a request to a server every after a given amount of time. For example, in JavaScript, we can use a set interval to let's say one minute and every after a minute, we send a request to the server and it will give us a response. So in case data has changed, we can then display it on our UI, but that is inefficient especially if you're having an application that has a lot of users so if all of them are sending a request to the server it can add up so another feature is seamless integration develop with Laravel, Laravel's broadcasting capabilities deploy with Reverb's first party 4G integration so Reverb is since it is built by the Laravel team itself it can be seamless to integrate across other packages in Laravel so it's also built for scale if it will increase capacity by utilizing Reverb's built-in support for horizontal scale using Redis, allowing you to manage connections and channels across multiple servers. So horizontal scales whereby you increase your server capacity by adding more servers. If you have one, you can add two more to make them three in case traffic is so high. Another feature is pusher protocol. Reverb utilizes the pusher protocol for WebSockets, making it immediately compatible with Laravel, Broadcasting, and Laravel Echo. For a demo, I have two browsers open. I have Chrome on the left and Firefox on the right. So if we scroll down to these emojis, as you can see, this this, this uh, site is deployed on, on Reverb. So, so on the left, if I click the heart icon, you'll see it come up here on the right, which is Firefox. So let me click the heart here, and you can see. So if I click the fire icon, if I click the spaceship icon, uh, mind blown icon, so if I start clicking them all, so this is this is all happening over WebSocket. So here over in Firefox, it is not polling the server; it is using a WebSocket connection and uh, displays data in real time. So if you don't subscribe to this channel, please do, because when uh, Reverb comes out, I will be making uh, a lot of tutorials on how to use it, which shall create a chat application, and learn more about it in general. Thanks for watching. See you then.